I just <laughs> like signs. It's something that I can carry, it's something I can put up on a wall. Do you want to go and take a look right now? Like sure. We can just head out. Sure. That'd be fun. All right. Huh? I sell signs in the shop all day long. I know what they sell for. I know what to pick them for. That's why I picked this pick for us. Come on in, folks. Hey. Holy just cow. Signs everywhere. That's a beauty right here. I'm like dumbfounded how many signs are in here, dude. I'm looking at all these nooks and crannies. There's signs stashed everywhere. Yeah, they are. I've probably got a thousand signs around here. I think they're beautiful. Jim, yeah. the Everetti sign. It looks like it's an early painted sign. The wood frame kind of dates it, yes. so it's early 1900s. Yes. yes. My brother taught me early on, buy the rare stuff. When's the last time you saw nine and a half cents gas? I bought that from a real old man that died. OK. And the last time I saw him, he said that's the only sign that he sold me that he wished he had back. And he sold me lots of signs. I've never seen a sign that said Everetti gasoline. I didn't know that Everetti gas had even existed. I've never seen one of them, have you? What, what, what was that That's noise? Huh? Oh, the peacocks, peacocks are talking peacocks. to us? <laughs> they said, don't sell that sign, didn't you hear that? Oh, is that what he was saying? <laughs> Holy cow, hopefully he can keep his mouth <laughs> Don't sell that sign. Oh. Yeah. What kind of money is that? A couple hundred dollars. I'll tell you what, I'm not gonna dicker on it. I love it that much. I mean, it tells okay. the story, and that's what it, this whole thing's about right here. Okay. I love it. The condition wasn't the best, but it's still a rare piece of history. And the bird loved it, too. <laughs>